Sean Andros, rxmuscle.com, here with the showstopper, Ben White, just after placing third at the Europa Battle of Champions. Uh, I think everybody in the building thought you had this show again. What happened up there? I mean, it never happened. We had some of the great guys from the last contest, and we all tried to critique and make ourselves better. And I guess Ed made himself better from the last outing, and he deserved to win. This. I mean, the point is, we all still qualify for the Olympia, so I'm happy. I mean, no matter how I look at it, I'm happy. I won my first pro show, top, placing the top three, and the judges, the judges are recognizing and taking me serious now, and not more of this right here. I'm doing more action now, baby. Now, what do you, how do you think you compared to last week when you won in Tampa? I mean, I was dry and harder this time, but I mean, just like I said, Ed was dry and harder too, so he, he edged me out, and plus he has a smaller waistline than me, so that looks even better when he does the last spread in front double bicep, but as far as the mass and everything else go, we all know who got that. <laughs> now, and also, now Troy edged out again, who you beat in Tampa, what do you think happened there? I mean, really, I, I don't know. I mean, I'm not the judges. I'm not the one down there calling it out. But if they see Troy deserves second, Troy deserves second. And um, that's it. I mean, I'm not arguing with nobody. I'm happy that I placed where I placed that. And in a short amount of time, what I'm doing, I'm happy. I'm happy. That's it. I mean, there's no other words. And all them bloggers out there, now what you got to say? Huh, huh? <laughs> ben is being very, very politically correct right now. Diplomatic, even. You you can you you gotta be because I mean people take confident confidence for arrogance or cockiness or whatever. I'm just confident in what I do and just like I said, if you didn't like me last time, I'm gonna change my physique. If you don't like this physique, I got about 15, 20 more pounds on, then I can't do nothing for you. So after that, being white shows I've tapped out, but I got another physique for y'all in the bag. I'm just waiting to bring it out. Like Ben said, for all the all the haters out there. We were just hoping you'd pull a top five this year. You won a show and you got third, so it's not bad. Yeah, qualified twice for the Olympia in one year. I mean, wow, that's a big accomplishment. That's what we're at. Stan, take note. I see you at the Olympia, but it won't be on the same stage. Because you're going to be on the bodybuilding stage, the Mr. Olympia stage, right? I'll be on the Mr. Olympia stage while Stan trying to lift and um, prove to everybody that he's strong. So. There's a little debate on rxmuscle.com as to whether you are a top 10 Olympia bodybuilder. And I say absolutely. If you put on, what, 25 pounds since last year? 25 pounds in, 20, about 20 pounds since last year. And you got another 10 weeks to keep getting better. What do you think you're going to bring to the Olympia stage? I mean, I'm going to bring the best BMW I can. This probably right here, about 90-something percent. I ain't bring that 100 percent package in yet, but I will definitely do it. And next time they see me out there, they're going to see the best of being white. We tell you right now. One of the best of being white, not the best. 10 weeks. I'm going up to Albany. Ben's coming down to Bev's powerhouse. 260, better condition on the Olympia stage, top 10. You're hearing it here first. You got that right. I mean, everybody can't stay at the top forever. You got people knocking and climbing, and that's me. All right. Here with very gracious and happy Ben White. Dang, ketogenic diet, number one, dog. <laughs> Check it out. <laughs> Still hitting poses for us. I got to. I only look like this. I only look good like this for two more days, and then it goes away. <laughs> Sean Andros, RxMuscle.com.